very good morning to all of you. In this video, we will see some automated libraries that are used for exploring your data. So for uh, your EDA, you can use some automated library available in Python. Okay, so in this video, we'll see the SwiftWiz library. Okay, so SwiftWiz library generates the report Okay, automatically generate the report in which it will automatically detect the numerical, categorical, and text features. It will summarize the information, unique values, missing values, duplicate rows, frequent values, all these things. It will automatically segregate. It will analyze the numerical and uh, features uh, and give us mean, max, average, quartiles, mean, mode, standard deviation, range, everything in a single report. Okay, so let's see how to use SwiftWiz for automatic EDA. So let's uh, import the necessary packages that is pandas and numpy. Then we are taking a data set, uh, diabetes data set. So let's see which data set it is. So based on number of pregnancies, glucose, blood pressure, thickness, insulin, BMI, DPF, age, we have to find out or the model have to find out whether a person is diabetic or not. So we have two categories, one and zero in the target variable. So for applying SwiftWiz library in that, we have to install SwiftWiz library using pip install SwiftWiz. After installing the SwiftWiz library, we have to import the library. So we are importing the library, import SwiftWiz as SV. Okay, so now we have to pass the data frame what is our data frame? Uh, this diabetes data set, we'll pass it in using analyze function. Okay, so when we'll pass this, it will create a automatic report generated and uh, basically it will create automatic report for univariate analysis. So now let's see. So it has taken all the columns like pregnancies, glucose, blood pressure, skin thickness, insulin, BMI, um, age, everything it has taken and has given e, uh, uh, these values for each and every individual column. Mean, max, median, range, IQR, standard deviation, kurtosis, QNS, everything it has given us all the uh, EDA things. Okay. So like this, it has given some univariate analysis, graphical things also. Okay, so like this, uh, it will make our task easy for exploring the data. Okay, so next we have another function called compare in SwiftWiz library. So it uh, it will it is helpful in comparing two data sets. Let's say we have two data sets like train and test, or we have two different data sets. So it will help in comparing. So we will use the compare function for that. So let's see how this is used. So it will also create a new uh, report. And uh, we can see that the report is like this. So it, it has created two data frame. One is represented by blue and second is represented by orange. So this is for first data frame. This is for second data frame. So for each and every, uh, for first data frame also, second data frame also, it has given all the information, range, IQR, standard deviation, everything for each and every uh, parameter, for each and every independent and dependent columns. Okay, so here it is uh, comparing the uh, comparing the two data sets using graph also. Okay, so like uh, for pregnancies, this is for uh, first data set, this orange is for second data set. So we can compare two data sets also using compare function in SwiftWiz library. Okay, so like this, uh, SwiftWiz is very helpful in um, automating the EDA part. So that's all about the EDA. Uh, that's all about the automatic EDA. So we have more libraries. Stay tuned for more automated EDA libraries. Till then, goodbye.